population of cats in my garden grows according to the logistic model below. In this problem, T is measured in weeks. How many cats can my garden support? So this is the, the limit, limit to growth or carrying capacity. And that is just the numerator of the logistic growth uh, model. And so 84 cats, that's how many uh, cats can, can live in my garden, which is apparently a very large and uh, uh, useful garden for the cats. B, what was the initial population of cats? Now, you can get this either by just memorizing the formula or just, this just means when t is zero. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. p of zero equals 84 over one plus 11 times e to the, well, this thing times zero, which is just zero. Now, anything to the zero is one. So this is one plus 11 times one, okay? That's 84 over 12. Uh, which is seven. Okay. So the initial population was seven. There are seven cats that started off in my, uh, in my garden. And now I'd like to know how many cats are present after five weeks. Well, T is measured in weeks, so this just means T is five. P of five. This is 84 over one plus 11 times E to the negative. 0 0.07 times 5. And we're going to go ahead and plug this into our calculator. We've got 84 over 1 plus 11 uh, e raised to the negative 0 0.07 times 5. And go ahead and control enter. Now, uh, this is talking about number of cats. And it doesn't really make sense for, uh, for us to have a decimal number of cats, okay? We can only have a whole number of cats here. So this, the nearest whole number here would be 10. Round to the nearest whole number would be about 10. So only about 10 cats um, after, after five whole weeks. So this is growing pretty slow. And that, that's determined by this number here, right? The smaller this number here is, uh, the, slowest, the slower the growth. And so, uh, you know, started at seven, we're at 10 cats after five weeks, but we do know that the limit uh, is, uh, is 84. So this is gonna start growing a little bit faster and eventually get really, really close to 84.